Morning folks. What a pretty day. My blue sky, sunshine. We got about an inch of snow last night, but it's been melting off just about as fast as it's been coming down. Look at these mountains. I'm going to have to set this up for a uh, time lapse here. What I usually do with these is uh, I put them on here. Oops, sorry. I put it on here on a tripod on the deck and then I speed it up afterward. I don't have a time lapse camera. But man, look at these mountains. Sped up, these clouds and things really look neat. They're actually moving pretty fast anyway. Boy, that's pretty. I never get tired of those. You know, it's funny, the, the mountains don't change, but they look different every time. At least they do to me, different cloud patterns, different snow patterns. Very pretty. She does love the snow. Okay. Kind of mean to throw a snowball. She'll never find it, but ready, Lily? Ready? Go get it. <laughs> good girl. She thinks she found it. That's good enough. There he is. There he was. One of those big uh pilated woodpeckers. Kind of look like Woody. One bad thing about these tracks is it throws snow into the back of this bed like crazy. There wasn't any snow in here when we left the house. An enclosed cab all the way back is really needed or some sort of a some sort of a cage with a tarp on it. Because of why you, you can't you get to digging for anything, you can't find it.
pretty quiet and empty up here. Not really seeing a lot of tracks. A few deer, mostly rabbits. Where my cameras are, are clear over on that ridge over there. Stopped here to glass a little and see if there's anything laying over there, but I don't see anything. When I first started guiding way back when, a lot of guys had uh, Savorsky binoculars and really nice ones. Those are thousands of dollars, some of them. And uh, they had all sorts of brands, but that one was kind of one of the one of the best. Toward the tail end of it, most of them folks had gone to Vortex. I got these for Christmas. My mom gave them to me. She didn't know it. She sent me some money. But uh, these are what they call their, their Triumph. I don't know if you can see that. It's got a little label on it. Maybe it's on this side. It is. Vortex Triumph. Uh, they're 10 by 42. They're really clear. And uh, the price is really good. They, they charge $100 for these. Brand new. I always wished I could film through them somehow. It really doesn't work, though. Kinda. <laughs> oh well. There's really no comparison to Savorsky binoculars. They're really good. Some of the clearest, best you can get. But like I say, they're they're a couple thousand bucks or more. And uh, these little Triumph Vortex, or any of Vortex, they have a lifetime guarantee on them. They're not a lot of money, and they're pretty darn good for the price. Well, Lily's going crazy. She wants to bite bushes so bad, that window doesn't come down. It's held up with zip ties. <laughs> Zipper in it's broke. So she's out of luck today. But like this one here, man, she wants to grab that bush so bad, that's just, just can't do it, kind of torture for her. that spot where my snares were. There are some older tracks there, but they're elk, and that's all. I haven't found a single elk track up here since, uh, well, since I ended up getting those ones. I don't think there are any. I think they've you know, wolves are so territorial, the rest of them, they, they will move in eventually, but uh, until they realize that this this area is open again and there's, there's no wolves here, then they won't move in. I bet next year, or hopefully by then, that uh, if not the year after, there'll be some more. Hopefully. Well, there's a whole bunch of elk over there, right where we need to go. So we're 
gonna have to probably run them off when we get close so they'll do it on their own I guess knob here hey no barking Lily can't tell in this viewfinder if I've got them in the camera or not there's one for sure Probably that same bunch I saw the other day, about 20 of them or so. Let's see, off to the side of that tree, I think, is one. And there goes my battery. I got more. Okay, try this again. Bunch of elk over there, clear up on the ridge even. And there's a raven. So there might be some of my cow left. Good to be seeing some elk. If there's any wolves around, you would think they'd be nearby them. drive over there and run them off but that's where I need to go galloping through here I probably stampeded them right on through as I drove up I didn't see them run but I was busy watching the road I was hoping they'd run right through over there the cow is right there get them on the camera it looks like I didn't get them more of that cow left than I thought there'd be with five eagles and at least two coyotes probably three coyotes at least it ain't gonna last very long boy I'll tell you what 
I have done something to my leg from studying on the computer I think it's sciatic nerve trouble it hurts <laughs> well it hurts from my butt down to my toes that um, my right leg is numb kind of hard to walk even there's a couple of spots I'd like to go and hike into and try hunting but uh, I don't think I can do it right now hopefully that goes away before long it's not much fun really seeing a whole lot of tracks around this mostly birds sure doesn't take them well that's very disappointing that first camera that had all the best pictures on it last time has nothing at all I don't know if my batteries gave out or maybe I didn't turn it on right it's hard to tell sometimes if that thing comes on or not I got those new rechargeable batteries that Doug sent me on the charger so I just put in the the other ones again today oh man yeah there's there's no way I could walk very far just yet Hopefully this goes away soon. There were tracks coming up to the top of this knob. But they look like coyote. Man, what a pretty day. It's cold though, my fingers are frozen. Well, I'll go check that other camera and get out of here. This cow is disappearing fast. Won't be too much longer, I won't have any bait here anyway. Oh, oh boy, my fingers are frozen. These sunshiny days are pretty, but boy, they don't keep the heat in very well. Well, this camera has 362 videos, so let's go see what we got.